how to create email template in Canva with MailChimp. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can create an email template for your campaigns or your email campaigns on MailChimp using the design tool, which is going to be Canva. The two platforms are going to be very uh, close to each other and also very customizable. And we have an integration within Canva that will help us also to integrate the designs to email chain. So you're going to head over first your email or your, uh, let's say, uh, email marketing platform, which is going to be MailChimp, sign in for an account within the platform. And then you are going simply to head over the integration. I'm going to select here the integration. And from here, we are going to type in Canva. And normally we are going to see the Canva appearing. As you can see here, we have Canva. So we are going to click on Canva, then we are going to simply click on connect. And this is the first step. Basically, it will show you here the list of the uh, accounts that you have for Canva. Then you're going to select the uh, one that you are going to work with. So I'm going to click on continue. We're going to set up here uh, the, uh, as you can see, uh, the parameters. And also we are going to permit the uh, authorization between uh, the two platforms, which is going to be an easy thing. So it is going to set up uh, here the thing easily. Now, what I'm going to do is to wait for the setup of the integration. When it is going to say that it is connected, as you can see here, we have the dashboard of the designs. So basically, we have zero design within Canva. So you can go ahead and create an email from here, view designs, and etc. So you can go ahead and click on here. Now that you have connected to Canva, you will have direct access to your images while building emails, uh, social posts, and more. So you're going to click on create an email or view the designs. So here we are going to create directly an email. I'm going to create it with a basic layout. The full designed one are not going to be meant for us. We're going to head over here. So we can go ahead and see that this is a standard or the standard MailChimp, uh, as you can see here, um, designer. But when you are going to head over here for the adding of the images, you can go ahead and uh, browse the image. And there you are going to see the Canva is going to be here. So you are going to see all the images or the templates or the designs that you have put in here. So it is going to be on the content studio. Instead of having here, uh, let's say a design, then you are going to download that design. After that, you are going to integrate it or upload it in here. You're going to have it just like this right away. So you are going to select the uh, type of the file that you want to add. Basically, it is going to be an image file like a GIF or GPG or PNG. Then you are going to click on sync now. It will take a little bit of time for synchronizing the data from Canva. As you can see, we have the same uh, let's say designs from this platform to this one it is going to add automatically here the image and it is going to be just like this so basically how we can uh, do that or proceed uh, the design from the scratch now i'm going to head over canva and then we are going to create for example email or type in email as a template now we are going simply to see all the Canva templates. And from here, uh, we are going to see the email template. So I have here a lot of templates. If you are going to create one from scratch, go ahead and create it. If you want to modify one from the, let's say here, preset or templates that has been given to you, go ahead and do that. Now I'm going to choose one of the templates that we have, and then we are going to apply some modification to and then we are going to proceed on how we can transform or transfer this, uh, let's say, template directly from Canva. There is also a way that we can enter, uh, transfer directly this specific one to the designs uh, without going to the, let's say here, uh, integration from uh, MailChimp. So I'm going to select this one maybe. So we are going to go with this template and customize it. And we are going to see the pages. So basically, I will not need uh, the second page. So I'm going to delete it. I'm going only to head over this one. 
or maybe you can go ahead with this one. I don't know. I do not have an idea yet, but we are. I, I, all I need to do is to, for example, here, uh, delete the uh, buttons that are not going to be, um, let's say, clickable because we are going basically here to uh, set up only static things and not movable things. So I'm going to only set up the static ones. For example, we are going to avoid your old type of buttons that we have. So for example here, well, I'm going to remove this and put our website. Just an example, Jax. And let's say here, we are going to delete some of the images that are not going to do or go well with our, let's say, uh, subject. So we are going to click on here. Maybe we are going to add over, I don't know here. Uh, I'm going to add this pizza, for example. Let's add it in here, just like this. And for example, here, I'm going to uh, click on share. This is how we can set up the, uh, as you can see here, the designs. And we are going simply to click on see all. And from these uh, integrations, we are going to normally see uh, here Melton. So we are going to see it normally on social. Let's see here all the messaging. This is it. On the messaging, you are going to see Melton. So I'm going to head over here and I'm going to delete all the content of this page. I'm going to create it from scratch. So let's go ahead and add a color. And from these, I have changed my mind. So I'm going to add some, let's say here, um, some actions or something that is going to be um, fascinating a little bit. I'm going to add here some colors and we are going to duplicate that and make it for the other side just like this. I'm going to take it in here. Let's see here if it is going to be symmetric or not. Maybe this is better. Maybe it is not perfect, but it is going to do uh, well. Just like that. Boom. So now I'm going to add here some, let's say here, this one. So we are going to write in it something. So I'm going to change the color of that. So the text is not going to be not, uh, let's say here, read uh, readable, maybe gray. I don't know. So we are going to choose a color, something that will go well with this design. So maybe like this, this is, I think, better. So we are going to add a text, a heading, for example. Welcome to our news letter, for example. I'm going to make it a little bit smaller. Just like that, we are going to put here uh, some frames of images. We're going to add frame. And these frames are going to be just like this. So maybe we are going to put it as small as possible because basically this is a going to be a literally a big design nice small one so we can go ahead and take advantage of that and we are going to add here maybe some uh, headings little headings in here and maybe some text boxes just like that i'm going to uh, duplicate the header in here so here i have added the images so we are going to start and add maybe some examples as image I don't know here, I'm going to put some photos. I'm going to insert some photos just like that. And maybe this one. And finally this one. This is just an example. So we are going to be putting up here, for example, maybe a, another image just like that. Put it in here at, to at the top here. So you're going to shape it a little bit in here, or you can go ahead and put it to the back and make it here just like that. Now what I'm going to do is to click on share, then we are going to see all, head over the messaging, click on MailChimp, connect MailChimp, and normally it is going to confirm the, uh, uh, let's say, the um, information. So we are going to put in here the uh, 
password again or you can go ahead if you see that already in here you're going to head over here delete the design that we have if you do not want to uh, put some promotion in here you're going to click on add browse click on uh, canva and you're going to see the last design that you have put so we are going to wait for the loading and it is going to be here normally uh, this one so we are going to see insert and finally we have the image or the design from it and also you can go ahead and add the different elements like your headings or the standard headings for mailchimp some images some products some uh, codes if you want some apps integrations and whatever like you've had uh, did before on the standard email uh, design you're only going to add some images and these images are going to be illustrating more your ideas on that email then you are going to click on save and exit and start sending up your email with the content set that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and i hope to see you soon on the next one